Hello everybody, this is Not A Crypto Expert chiming in with another video. In this video, I'm going to simulate the purchase of Ether uh, or Ethereum that has the symbol ETH. Uh, this is one of the ones that, excuse me, this is the cryptocurrency that to me has uh, one of the more important values going forward. It's not just a um, measurement of wealth or uh, something to hold money it's actually a, a, a platform that can be used for the main thing for smart contracts so that's why or at least in my opinion that's why I feel that it's going to be essential going forward to cryptocurrency as a whole so the first thing that you would do or that I would do anyway is uh, I always like to look at the chart on coin market watch is one of the websites or excuse me coin uh, yeah school coin market cap uh, as of right now, the price has fallen, uh, but as you know, if you've been following crypto, the past three weeks have been a bloodbath. However, things are starting to uh, still kind of move back up. But in this instance, we're going to be purchasing, simulating the purchase on Binance. So the first thing that you would need to do, excuse me, the second thing that you would need to do would be to log in. I did not want to have myself automatically logged in because I wanted you to see me logging in and hopefully I remember my password all right just remember to slide this over and it's gonna ask for my authentication code which is on my mobile device so give me one moment to pull that up and then I will type this number in And this is a code that changes uh, every 30 seconds to a minute, I believe. Okay. All right, so I am now logged in. I'm gonna go to the home page, and I'm gonna assume that we've got Bitcoin in this particular exchange before this has even been done. Uh, if you do not know how to transfer Bitcoin to and exchange I've got a video on that on the YouTube channel well, let's go on ahead and let's copy the symbol it's not like it's very hard it's only three characters come back over to Binance paste that in the search and click on it and let's say we're balling we're gonna buy a thousand shares so like I always do I always do the market so click on that At this point we would just click buy ETH and if I click on it it's gonna give me an error message stating that there is no balance so but if you did that would be it and as long as there was someone to fulfill that order you would have a, uh, a prompt stating that the order has been completed in the upper right hand corner of the screen so certainly hope that you found this helpful 